the top 10 things that annoy judges the most about attorneys. Number 10, the attorney distorts the facts. Number 9, the attorney miscites cases. Number 8, the attorney repeats him or herself. Number 7, the attorney belabors a ruling. Number 6, the attorney is chronically late. Number 5, the attorney interrupts the judge or opposing counsel. Number 4, the attorney is unprepared. Number three, the attorney is arrogant or patronizing. Number two, the attorney infers incompetence. And the number one thing that annoys judges the most about attorneys? The attorney implies the judge is incompetent. Good morning. Good morning. Hello, Clint. Uh, good morning, Meredith. Here we go again. Yes, round two. Oh, how was your conference in Monterey? Okay, but I only got to Pebble Beach once. How was Cancun? Uh, it was great. Scuba diving was incredible, and you were right. That hotel recommendation, it was the best. I'm glad you liked it. So, uh, where's Mr. Lewis? I don't know. Why can't all attorneys be as punctual as you are? Well, we wouldn't want them all to be as obsessive compulsive as I am. <laughs> Thank you for honoring us with your presence, Mr. Lewis. I'm sorry I'm late. Calling the matter of Boggs versus Bulow. Counsel, please state your appearances. Clint Weston for Bulo. Mr. Lewis, Mr. Lewis, if I'm not interrupting you, I would like to get started. Yes, Your Honor. I was just reviewing my motion. Mr. Lewis, you are appearing for Boggs. Yes, Your Honor. Uh, as I state in my demur... Counsel, you know in this court you stand when you make your argument. As I st state in my demur, the basis for my filing this motion is I have evidence that the plaintiff wasn't even in the car. Therefore, the injuries he claims from the accident are a false suit. Counsel, I am not taking evidence on a demur. But, Your Honor, if... The plaintiff wasn't even in the car. Mr. Lewis, I am not here to give you a legal education. Your entire motion demonstrates a complete lack of understanding of what a demur is. These are the worst papers I've ever seen. A first-year law student could do better. I suggest that you go back to basics, Mr. Lewis, and fill in the parts that you slept through. And I hope you have your checkbook with you. I believe I'm raising a valid point. I would be delighted to hear a valid point if you've got one. But Judge, my client doesn't have money to defend this lawsuit. He shouldn't be put through the cost of this when I have clear proof that the plaintiff wasn't in the car. Counsel, your client is dirty on this one. I suggest you settle this case. Now, you have wasted enough of this court's time, as you have repeatedly throughout the year. Not only am I overruling the demur, I am ordering you to pay $500 in sanctions forthwith. <laughs> 